Hello everyone, this is Stevie O, and we are back in the 50s, back trying to make a dollar. Why does everyone have all their fields planted but me? Huh, what is that guy doing with that old picker? There. Wow, this farming community's hopping and we're not doing anything. Oh, an old plow. This guy's planting, and we are not. Look at that narrow front John Deere. What is that? A 620, I believe? I couldn't quite make out when he was driving so fast. Some type of s spreader or cedar there. Man, there's a lot of stuff going on, and we are not in the field. We have had a ton of setbacks, a ton of breakdowns. It just really hasn't been that easy for us so far here in the 50s. Today, we're going to buckle down. We're going to get some fields planted. I'm hoping. It did rain a little bit here this morning. It's a little sticky on top. So we're going to try get everything ready. I might do a little bit of chiseling just prior to our farmhand, Timmy. He's in the field. He's running. Where's little Timmy at around here? Is he still going around? Oh yeah, he is still on his first pass, really? Oh man, this is gonna be a while. I think I see him way out there. Way out there over the hill. Yeah, if you could see here, uh, everything's grown in the field except my corn. Uh, I'm gonna have to cultivate this. Uh, obviously we plowed it. We got a get that a little bit nicer than that well yep i see little timmy if you could see him right over there coming over the mountain top there yeah little timmy has a uh, least all day let's just say all day over there all right this bad girl started here go just harrowing this down a little bit here maybe I can get my wife to run this old girl this is my newest tractor here my uh, 720 it might putt putt a lot but it is one of our strongest tractors here So I got my wife to drive. She was uh, a little PO because she had a tea party today. Uh, but hey, this is what pay the bills. This is what we need to do. The banker, he's not happy with us. Little Timmy, you know, he's running in the field. I feel kind of bad for him. He is really just creeping along here. I mean, look, we're just walking along here. What's up, Timmy? Yep. See? He's focused. Straight ahead. Love that. Laser focus. I gave my wife the newer tractor, so we do have, I guess, let's see. I don't know if I wanted to get it on the Minneapolis Moline or the John Deere Model A. I think maybe I'll try the John Deere Model A because the Minneapolis Moline is on the drill. I don't really want to... Uh, Move that around so we're gonna get on to our four roll planter here we go uh oh Does this thing start hopefully this thing starts all right yep started now all right we got our fertilizer in our dry fertilizer 
and we got our seed in. So we are ready to go. This is one of the most advanced planters out there in the 50. Alright. It's time to finally get some corn kernels into the soil. I'm gonna have to tell little Timmy he could put it into second gear. He doesn't have to creep along in first gear because wow. He's gonna be there in a little while. Alright. We are planting away now. Try to leave this just right. Alright. Didn't know what the Model A still had it in it. Of course it does. And it's one of the best sounding John Deere out there. All these putt putt John Deere's. Probably one of my favorite sounding tractors. Oh man, my wife's picking up the speed now. She's leaving a little bit of weeds around there though. You can see there's a. Hopefully, I, I can already hear Timmy coming around there. Yeah. Poor thing. Yeah, he says he needs to put beeswax into his ears when he drives that thing. So we can hear at the end of the day. We just got this little itty bitty 10 acres here. And uh, Timmy's, uh, that's, he's plowing the back 40. So this 10 acres should be easy to get this done today. Uh, hopefully my wife, Timmy, can get far enough ahead so my wife can get uh, start going around there. So maybe, if I'm a little lucky, I can start planting into that field. Get out of here, bud. Scat. Scat. Get out of here. I'll go get my bird shot. You guys keep on thinking that you can uh, just come peck at my fields. Stinking buds. Who is this? Who exactly is this? What, 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 what exactly? You don't have to drive in my field, buddy. Alright, so he asked if he could go catch some panfish or some bass or some catfish. He's hoping for some catfish out of the pond. He, uh, they, the family has fell on hard times. Usually let him go fish in my pond in the back, and they uh, pay me back, give me some uh, fish fries once in a while. Hold up, hold up, hold, oh, oh, whoa, whoa, that was quick. I guess my wife is in a mission to get this done. Yeah, she is not messing around over there. used the Model A quite a few years, it's still ticking for us. Uh, the four-wheel planter is uh, new this year. Yeah, it's probably gonna... Uh-oh. Uh -oh. What is this about? He, he's driving on my planted field over there. What? What is up, buddy? Oh my goodness. Oh man, you have to excuse him sometimes. He doesn't know farming etiquette. Dude, you don't. You could just run me down. He bagged on something while he was fishing. He believes there's a tractor in the pond. I'm not joking. Can you believe that? He swear to me that there is a tractor in the bottom of that lake. He says he thinks he sees something else, but he swears it's an object of a tractor. I don't know, I guess all the algae in the water just made the water super clear right now. Usually it's really mucky, mucky green. You've probably all seen it, either nasty brown, mucky green, you know, the normal pond. But for whatever reason, our pond is extremely clear this spring. Looks like he's already down there. Alright, yeah, he raced down there again. Alright, let me start up the dodge here. Back her up here. He pretty much is jumping up and down. Can't wait for me to get over there. Alright. 
Look at little Timmy go there. Uh, is this the way down here? What the heck is he doing? Is he supporting that tree right there? He must be uh, sitting under the shade or something. Alright. So he says it seems like it's about right here. I'm going to get my truck as close as possible. You can usually see easier into a pond if you're up higher. I climb up on my cab here. Yeah, yeah, here we go. Oh, wait, you could just barely see the silhouette. How can we get that? Oh my. Uh, I really want to see if I can pull that thing out. I do have a winch on the front of this old Dodge. Let's see. So, I don't know if I can string this out. Uh, I guess I'm going to have to uh, hold my breath and hopefully get down in there. Let's unreal this. Alright, pull this out. Uh, here we go. Hold a breath. Oh, there is. There's. There's. Oh, oh that. You saw it, didn't you? All right, let's try to hook it up this time. All right, hooked it up. All right, let's see if we can start winching this thing up. All right, slowly does it. Let me pull this back. All right, all right, come on. Here we go. Oh. My daddy always told me about this. He told me there was a rumor running around here that there was a tractor, an old Ford tractor, stolen from a farmer and was never found. And it was rumored that it was in the bottom of one of these ponds around here. I thought he it was just an old man's tail. But he was right. Look at this thing. This is so cool. It is rusted to pieces. It's been down there a few years. Usually this pond is so nasty, so dirty, so full of, uh, let's say, cow urine and uh, feces that you can't hardly even see to the bottom of that pit. The old story was the sheriff caught wind, so they had to dispose it into the pond, and it was true. Thank you all for watching. I will see you next time over here in the 50s. I guess the old Ford Model A can get it done. If you want to play with all these mods and more, check out Apex Game PC. They make a PC for anybody's needs. Just use code squad, save a ton. You can get my PC by just looking at the description right below. Later, y'all, make sure you like the video. Thank y'all, you're the best.